Couldn't get a shot off there. He throws a hit on Watherspoon in the near side. Corner back down low. Here's Winquist. Comes free. Here's Petrick shooting. Oh, it's blocked out front. Down into the corner. Rutkowski trying to clear. Just past Murray. They're able to get it down. Tips will have to hustle here. They won't get icing. This puck won't go far enough. 20 seconds to go. Yudlowski stops behind his own net. He'll start the final rush. Right side, Ryan Murray. Ducks around a winner, Hawk. Murray into the offensive zone right side. Plays it down the boards. Carruth out to play it. Eight seconds to go. Tip fell. He out front shot. Oh, and the net goes off automatically. The winner, Hawks, purposely put the net off as Reed Petrick had a wide open goal to shoot at. And the winner, Hawks, presumably there on purpose, knocked the net off with five seconds to go. Matt Carruth diving on top of the back of the net. That should be a penalty shot for the Silver Tips here. Reed Petrick was about to shoot as a wide open goal as Matt Carruth came up behind the net to play the puck. And got caught. The Silver Tips got a turnover. Fowley moved it out into the high slot. Reed Petrick was going to have a wide open net to shoot at. He fired it toward the net, and with five seconds left, the Silver Tips are going to get a penalty shot. Matt Carruth intentionally knocking the net off. And the Silver Tips are going to have Josh Burkholz put the game on his stick, I think, here on a penalty shot. Again, Carruth got caught out of the net as the Tips crashed along the end boards. They're a great hustle by Everett to get to that puck and overload the puck along the end wall. They were able to get it from Carruth, and then again, Fowley sent it out into the high slot. Petrick. was all by himself and had a wide open net to shoot out when Carruth just did a swan dive right over the back of his own net there to knock it off of its moorings and really knock it right over on its front. If the net would have slid off laterally, then maybe you could make a case that he didn't do it on purpose. He was just trying to get back in front, but literally he jumped on the back of the net and turned it over on the front of the cage. And they're talking it over over here at the official's crease. I do believe that in this scenario rather than just a power play that the tips could be awarded a penalty shot I haven't read the rule book cover to cover in a while but I do believe that it is within the right of the official here to call for a penalty shot the puck is on the ice at center here and now they're getting the explanations Ryan Murray talking with the officials here, and most of the conversation is directed toward Murray here, which leads me to believe the Silver Tips are not happy with whatever the officials have decided, only just judging by body language out there outside the officials' crease. The puck is sitting in the blue dot at the center ice face-off circle, and it is a penalty shot, it looks like, for Josh Winquist. Winquist has been very good in this scenario this year. He will go one-on-one with Matt Carruth, and the game will be on his stick. Josh Winquist this year in the shootout is two for six. He is one of the most efficient shooters the tips have got. Winquist picks it up at center for the game to tie it for the tips. Left-handed shot moves in. Backhander stopped by Matt Carruth with 4.7 seconds left. The penalty shot fails, and that may have been Everett's last hope. Matt Carruth with a big save there as Winquist was waiting for Carruth to make the first move. Slowly moving in there and trying to pick the goaltender apart, but Carruth really never did make a move. He outweighed Josh Winquist on the play. Kicked it loose. Watherspoon. Centered, intercepted. Petrick's block by Ratty. What a block by Ty Ratty. And Roth hacks it down the length of the ice. No icing as it doesn't go past the goal line. Huge block by Ty Ratty in front of the net as Petrick was all alone. 17 seconds remaining in the third. Coming to center, here comes Murray. He goes around Ratty. Into Hawk territory. Ryan Murray cycles it behind the net. Carruth out of his net. Almost turns it over. Centering pass! And the net got knocked off by Matt Carruth. And it's a penalty shot. Carruth ran into his own net. Knocked it off its moorings after he had trouble behind the net. Penalty shot for the Silver Tips with 4.7 seconds remaining. Matt Carruth in behind his net, turned the puck over, it got centered, and Carruth 
knocked his net off its moorings. There's going to be a penalty shot here. Matt Carruth will have to face a penalty shot. They're on the phone. Towards the upstairs here, the video replay, as they want to review it. I'm not quite sure what they want to review. The puck never went into the net. The net got knocked off its moorings. Not sure what they're reviewing here. As Matt Carruth tried to play it up the wall, it was a turnover. 4.7 seconds remaining. The centering pass came out, and it was shot wide of the net. In the high slot, as the net was being knocked off its moorings, it was difficult to tell whether the puck would have actually been on net. Carruth crashed into his own net, knocked it off its moorings, and a penalty shot was ruled. They are now reviewing with the video replay to the bo- in the booth to my left. I don't know what they're reviewing, whether or not the puck potentially went into the net before it was knocked off its moorings, but the net was off before the shot was even taken. Review right now going on. Brett Monsion has the phone up to his ear, communicating with the video goal judge up at the booth to my left. Justin Nickel is the video goal judge, in case you were wondering. Monsion on the phone right now. It's going to be a penalty shot for the Silver Tips. seconds remaining in regulation. Penalty shot coming. Matt Carruth, who came out of his net to play the puck, had it bounce off a body, centered out to the high slot area, and Petrick shot it up and over a net that was knocked off its moorings. So a penalty shot will be taken. It'll be Winquist to take it. 4.7 seconds left. Winquist. Penalty shot. Matt Carruth will face it. Here comes Winquist. Picking up the puck. Left hand shot. Weaving in. Right up the middle. Slows down to the backhand. Save! Matt Carruth with the left pad. Robs Josh Winquist. Huge save for Matt Carruth to preserve the one-goal lead for the Winterhawks. Brad Ross comes out and hugs Carruth. There's still 4.7 seconds remaining here. Face-off coming to the left of Carruth's net. Hawks will have to kill the final 4.7 seconds. Carruth comes up big. Winquist made a move to the backhand. Carruth stuffed him with the left pad. 4.7 